Uh, I just want to know what your thoughts were when uh, the penalty was called for roughing the passer. Man, I felt like I got home on time. Uh, I guess a great time by the ref. Do you think they were explaining the penalty to why they're calling it? Did they ever say that? What are they just called? I think my big, not being below the waist, just getting my head in the throw in there. I think God sold out for the guys next to them um, all across up front. I mean, just the time we spent. Do you feel like the group is getting progressively better? Um, game after game, based you know, the pass rush working off of each other. Yeah, just feeding off each other, um, controlling our emotions. Um, like I say, just selling out for the guy next to you, and just as we grow, just building a brotherhood and. And, really and also just coming up the bottom and just re re picking it up. Could you watch the fourth quarter stats while the receivers are able to go with dominate? Like how it happened? Yeah. yeah. I want to say boy slid. I don't I just remember. How much impact do you feel like you're having for those edge guys? I mean, Romello gets two sacks this game. Solomon gets two more sacks. Uh, what kind of impact do you feel like you're having for those edge guys? I mean, just keeping guys up, making sure that they know I'm here for them. And, you know, I know a lot of guys are depending on me just from the energy piece. So just keeping guys up and letting everybody know up front that we're good. We're good. We got it. It seems like you're getting more and more comfortable as far as communicating with your teammates on the sidelines, being that energy guy. Is that something you, you're growing into, you feel like? Yeah, you know, just growing into the leadership, bro. I mean, some men Coach Riley talk about a lot. Just... Just being able to be vocal, be a vocal leader, and pick guys up, bring them with me. How different did it feel like what you guys had seen on tape the first three games versus what they had like him calling the plays? Who? The head coach called the plays this game versus the offensive coordinator. Did it feel like it was different from what you guys had seen on film the first couple of games? Not really. Some of the guys were here tonight. I'm thankful for them. And What's the mindset aspect that got to happen when it Colorado? There was a lot of days when we went through two of those. Uh, just two cleaning up the mistakes Monday, having a great week of practice next week. Because a lot of people are getting out of it. You guys, do you think you took what you guys did wrong. during the bye week and carried it over to this week? Being out there and like having that development and having that coaching. Left back in the bye week. What got left back home in LA that you guys didn't carry over to this game during the bye week practice? I say just starting fast. I mean, it's our first away game, and just just taking that week off. Um, I think that played a big factor. They had a crowd of fifty thousand plus. Uh, how much do you think that crowd affected your guys' play today? I mean, not much. I know during warm ups, guys, was, I mean, people in the stands just calling our names, saying all types of crazy stuff, but just uplifting each other, making sure we just control the noise. And we play, like Coach Riley said all the time, we play on our terms, nobody else. Thank you, Barry.